Hi guys, it's me again, Josiah. Another beautiful, uh, you know, uh, Saturday afternoon. Tomorrow, so uh, Easter Sunday. So, making sure, make it, you know, uh, make sure I got got this right. Okay, let me see. What, let me get my notes over here. You know, it's an interesting thing I was digging up. Because you're bored to stay at the house, you're staying in the home. You want to, you know, do some do a little research. Okay. Okay. All our five states in the union right now are not on lockdown. That's North Dakota, South Dakota, uh, Nebraska, Arkansas, and Montana. Okay. They're not, you know, I might be wrong, but, you know, this is what, North Dakota, South Dakota, Nebraska, Arkansas, and Montana. Why are all these states are no, uh, not locked down? Well, because most most major major areas of that are, uh, you know, are not you know major you know they're, they're not major urban centers. Los Angeles, uh, we call this a, is an urban center. California has a lot of urban centers. Uh, New York has a lot of urban centers. Uh, Illinois, Chicago has a lot of urban centers. Milwaukee, a lot of urban centers. But these areas here are open areas. So you can drive. Actually, man, if I can get a rock. You know, I, I, you know, I can hit my neighbor that maybe never, because everything's spaced out so far over there. Over here, you know, uh, you know, Vegas, that especially Las Vegas, is, even though it's spread out, it's still an urban, you know, it's still an urban area. Okay, if you look at my house over here. I'm still, you know, you know, we call us, you know, I can still meet people. Or everybody's staying in. So people are complaining. How come you know NPR, National Public Broadcast, uh, you know, you know, uh, you know, station, liberal? They're complaining. How come in this store, you know, in these places are not locked down? Well, you know why. You know why. These places have been you know, uh, very fragile economies. Mom, a lot of mom and pop stores. If I close, you know, if you close those things down, their economies can shut down. That's why we call it, it's very important to that and this place has remain open in that base. You know why? You know, they have no industry to that supporting them. Okay? If those things shut down to that, you know, for Pete's sake of that, you know, what, what happens? Okay. Everybody's gonna go to roll and, and and also those areas like that if you uh, North Dakota, Wyoming, South Dakota no, I'm sorry, North Dakota, South Dakota, Nebraska, okay, are in Arkansas. Montana, they're in the middle of, uh, especially Montana, Nebraska, South Dakota, Montana. They're all in the middle. So we call us they're uh, in the in the cross section of the America. If you shut those places down, like that it's you not know, they say as they say, it stops the supply line. Because you know the text right now they close the borders. We can't ha allow that to happen over there. Like that because if we do close those border, close those areas to like that. You know, a little bit the hardest, says, especially farmers. They need to get their stuff out of the way. You get into the markets that, and they need those trucks. And and also that we need, you know, uh, we need a you know fast thoroughfare. And number two of that, you know, those people over there are you know very dependent. You can't tell people those people over there like they go go stay in because they've been out all their lives. That us over here live in urban areas that you know we understand, but you know. You know, people uh, had to, uh, you know, especially if you're from like Republican states, they're very independent minded. Anything with in the uh, in the Democrat controlled states that we're we're at, we are more cooperative because you know we're more amiable. We're, we're you know we're into the into the group stuff. That's the thing. That's that's why that's why that you know that's why that those governors are reluctant to shut them down, shut those places down because you know why the constituents will not agree with them. And that's that's the battle right now. In my opinion, that you know, we call us leave like that, because the reason is that you know, if you do shut those places down like that, you know, guess what happens to that? You know, those people that will you know uh, will lose their uh, their livelihood. Okay, you shut you know, if you shut down, you know, what's what's an essential thing over there? Farmers essential, some source essential, feed source essential. You shut those places down. Okay, if I live somewhere in the middle of uh, you know, Nebraska like that, or I need to go somewhere like that, say, you know, I don't know, to buy something like that, and if that place is closed, I'm screwed. Right now, look at this, and right now, okay, over here, if you go to a major uh, supermarket over here, okay, in like Albertsons, you, you're going to stand in line in Las Vegas because, you know, the limit of getting in the place there because of, 
you know, with social distancing. Which is, it kind of sounds uh, weird to that, but, you know, sounds, uh, you know, uh, funny to that, but, you know, it's the way it is to that. And do I agree with it? I don't agree, but, you know, I'm not in charge. Sorry about that. Ooh, 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 ooh. Son. Ah, damn it. Do you agree with that? No, I don't agree with that. You know, it, you know, you know, but you know, I'm not the one running things, okay? As they say that, you know, did I agree with my governor over here doing this and shutting the place down? You know, I can complain all, all my life, all, all I want, but I'm not the governor, okay? I'm not the one in charge of that. So, you know, kudos to him. He, you know, we call us, you know, uh, you know, we call us that, you know, even though I'm mad at that about it, but you know, if he thinks that's the way it is, that's the way it is. And, uh, you know, it, you know, we call us, it, you know, you know, he's the performance, uh, in the, in the, he's a performance uh, position. So, you know, we call this, uh, it's, a, it's, it's for the voters to decide, you know, you know, because the reason is one thing I learned in life, do not mess with somebody's livelihood. Okay. If you cost them a job, that's, you know, you're, you're asking for it. That's why that you know it's it's locked down. A lot of people are you know we're at, at unemployment. Okay, and get this, we're gonna drain the resources. The government will you know why call us that will you know will go bankrupt with that because you know we're gonna go over budget to that. There'll be a lot of uh, especially democratic states. A lot of them will go to the red because it's unemployment thing. Is it a political thing? If it is so, that sounds stupid, that because you just shot yourself in the foot, you bankrupt your state. Like I say, California said, right? The governor Newsom said, "We're gonna, you know, you know, you know, we're gonna, you know, he's gonna endure this and that." But his his place is on the red already. It's maybe like, maybe, maybe like we call this that you know, is the next next thing to do is like you know, sell his uh, sell half of California to that because you know they're in hawk already. He's just not admitting it, okay? If you look at the, the you know uh, some areas of California right now that some towns of that are not you know we call us you know uh, are not functioning right now and they're on the red some counties on the red like in uh, like in Illinois like New York they just start not telling you that that's why we call have you noticed one thing that if the if your government raises your fines at that for some, some kind of infraction they're getting money for you from you you know why because you know we generate money we generate taxes. You know, if your government is trying to do that, then, you know, we call this that, you know, in other words, that your government is really broke. I'm a businessman because I understand one thing like that, you know, you know, the government needs people, people, you know, people need, people need government like, uh, like, uh, like to make sure everything's in order, but not take over their lives. Okay. My opinion is this, okay. When, uh, when the, the economy does, maybe around June of that, restarts this economy again, okay? Because mainly that we had a slow start. You got to open, open the markets out. And, you know, because in the middle of May of that, if, the, if, if it does open in May, a lot of business will declare bankruptcies and more, and, and there'll be a transition point. It will take time for get that, you know, to know for that economy to roar. So maybe July or August is going to go further. And I don't believe that we, we're not going to, uh, I don't believe that this, uh, Locked, it's locked out to the last until the whole year. You know why? It's career suicide, economic suicide. It's like a, it's like a Russian, it's like a favorite, it's like a, like, okay, we shut down all, let's say we shut down all the hamburger places around the country and that, and open them up in a, in a, in a, in a December. People will move on from hamburgers to eat something else, Okay. That's how people, you know, you know, customers are fickle, okay. You know, if they, if they say the government bans hamburgers, people will find something else to eat, fill the cheesesteaks. That's the same thing. That that's why it's not. You know, we call this, you know, uh, you know, this thing right now is tricky, because you know, uh, you know, every governor is just, you know, even though they hate Trump, they're just, you know, hoping that you know he's the one who announced it. Trump's the leader. I'm sorry to tell you that, okay? If Governor Sisolak over here in Nevada like that, you know, we, we call this, you know, uh, he has no clue. He doesn't know what's going on. And when Trump says, do it, he has to oblige. He has to do it. If not like that, you know, we call this that he's going to lose support. So just guys, that, you know, uh, that's what's going on right now. So 
There's some states, you know, there's some states that you know uh, it's still uh, uh, not full lockdown. So I think you know, we're you know, we are uh, in a, you know some states. If you drive to a different state than that, you notice that when stores are open, chances are the reason is that the governor is establishing a full lockdown. Okay, enjoy it, guys. Have a nice time, and remember one thing: enjoy your time. Okay, I know we're not making money right now, but you know. What could you do with that? You spend time with your family, spend time with them. Because you know why? Time goes by fast, you never know what's going to happen next.